Okay, this is my old reed, my old Ross reed, the cane one that came with my small pipes 20 years ago. And I took a normal practice channel reed here, pulled off the hemp, and cut the staple off at the end, about the, the hemp's length worth of the staple. And then, because my small pipe chanter, my small pipe chanter is in the key of A, I had to sharpen up the reed, so I clipped a good quarter of the reed off and then sanded it down until it stopped squeaking. And that was the practice chanter reed that you heard in the small pipes. Very simple to simple to do, though I don't think I'd recommend it with any practice chanter reed. I, you know, it probably just might not work. It might, but I don't know. I wouldn't recommend it. That is the length of the overall reed. I cut a quarter inch of the staple off. Just using my trusty little thing here. Okay, and the blade length might vary depending on the reed and how stiff the plastic is but you can go ahead and start clipping that down until it comes into tune and then you have to sand it down until it stops squeaking and it becomes compliant and if it's cutting out just keep on clipping it and sanding it down then I took it right in the middle and squeezed that open if, because this reed was a little bit soft just squeeze it open under the plastic down here and then that made a pretty darn good small pipe uh, pipe channel read.